welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the scorpion sun moon and rising i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this has been a wonderful wonderful time the month of august have five weeks five weeks ladies and gentlemen boys and girls that month of august have five weeks okay what we're going to do in this five weeks is that we're going to go back before after we listen to this um, reading and go back to the monthly readings and we are going to listen to the fourth week of august in the monthly reading because there will be information coming off that of the monthly reading that is going to coincide with this weekly reading ladies and gentlemen thank you thank you so much for supporting my channels thank you for this wonderful experience thank you for this beautiful beautiful um, situation that is coming and that we both are sharing together because you you scorpions you rock honestly this is somebody else's um, thing there but honestly you scorpion thank you so much thank you I want to say to each and every person please leave a message behind because by leaving a message we're sharing the energy or energy with other people to also heal other people and as we do that we will feel the energy coming back with at us with love and please um, I I'm asking just people to be positive okay be positive you have to learn to be positive it's not easy but you have to learn to be positive because of the changing of the guards okay well I want to say I haven't seen anything about your relationships so that's going to be good I'm seeing happiness and joy happiness so um, whatever is going on so let's see what is going to be the energy I am seeing the energy of the sword this week is the week of fire and earth we begin the week Monday and Tuesday with the energy of fire we can see that already and we end the the, the um, a week from Wednesday till Sunday with the energy vibration of the harder um, of the hurt so let's see what messages are coming in for you um, for you scorpion what are the messages coming in for you scorpions what are the messages coming in for you scorpions okay the number three is going to be one of your numbers in this week because the energy and the focus of the number three is here um, what it whatever is happening you have um, the major arcana you have uh, three major arcana which is very good for you scorpion whatever is happening the number three is going to sp um, play a significant role the number three energies have to do with the ascendance masters and it also has to do with uh, connection working together with groups of people um, four five three three is uh, um is uh, play a significant role in our lives okay um the energy of uh, six six three is going to play a significant life in role in our lives you scorpions got the ace of cups this is wonderful congratulations you scorpions um this is a positive positive energies for you guys because you have the energy vibration of the ace of cups in this week so this is going to be positive so whatever endeavor it is a new love is coming in your life and of course i was seeing this playing out two weeks now that um new love is coming in your life and yet still you're trying to get rid of one relationship to start a new relationship there is new love coming in your life so you the full what is happening for you guys behind the scene is that new love is coming in your life okay as we look at this week we have an air energy and with this air energy it is the energy of the magician the magician is here with the energy of the king of swords so um, this king of swords can be coming in to work with you or against you it depends on who you are and whatever vibration energy and whatever cosmic um, situation that you and this king of swords has to deal with okay so you need to understand that whenever we come in contact with people like this uh, whether it's in a good um, way or a bad way it has to 
um, an effect on um, certain aspect of yourself or a certain people who you have to work in and this would be the energy of the Aquarians the Gemini's and the Librans so I am getting the, the feelings to ask um, in what aspect is uh, this situation playing out with this king of swords because I don't think it's in a bad way it's in a work situation that you are going to meet this person and this person is going to help you uh, to build something in your life so there we are we got the message the answer on um, on Tuesday we have the energy vibration of the six of swords and finally it is in reverse so whatever um, negative energy whatever negativity that was coming at you it is finally in reverse it's as if it's uh, it is now blocked it's as if uh, um, whatever that was happening or whatever was coming at you or whatever effect what it was happening around you it is no longer all your burdens and this negative things are all in the reverse form that means that whoever that was sending you negativity in whatever way um, is now this is now more to affect you this is really in a reverse form so this is extremely good so whatever that was happening to you whatever that was um, affecting your life um, whether there are people sending these negative energies to you or you but this is science so this is negative energy that has been sent from people to you it's 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 in the reverse it's not hurting you couldn't hurt you so they're stop giving out their money to do these things okay because really and truly people I'm amazed um, the last time I'm so amazed at what people do when you're not aware of what they're doing and this is this is something okay I um and, and and people who you thought wouldn't do those things oh my god you're you're really amazed and surprised sometimes so this is going to come out and you're going to see this whatever is happening okay but the bird is over and um, if you're going to realize that your energy level is much more higher the crowning of your week is the nine of cups and the nine of cups or the ten of cups the nine of cups have the energy vibration of happiness so you are going to feel a sense of happy and I can imagine why because you're leaving a situation behind so okay all right so I guess some people have really decided to leave that relationship behind because whatever it, that was happening uh, because the science is ending so apparently they okay I'm getting this for someone out there I don't know who you are but the message is that uh, whatsoever the that woman was doing to you she realized that it wasn't working so um, she's letting go she's she's not giving out the money anymore she's really letting go of that happiness is coming in because you're leaving a situation behind a situation that you know no longer serve you you're releasing it and leaving it behind so a lot of people are going to be happy in this week because it's as if you have realized that certain relationships uh, um, it's unhealthy certain relationships it's not what you want certain relationships there was a manipulating sense that was driving the relationships and you're leaving this behind whatever it was you're leaving it behind so but for the rest of the people it's going to be a very very happy week um, for you guys so on Tuesday Thursday is the healing day whatever the situation is I realize that the universe is sending a healing day in each and every week your healing day the hermit comes up so you guys will be working on the masculine aspect of your mighty I am present self on the Thursday okay this on Thursday you will be working with the the aspect of the mighty I am present self on Thursday so this is going to be there is going to be a situation that is going to be happening for you guys and on Thursday you're going to see this playing out and once you heal that masculine aspect of yourself or of a situation that has been you know a powerful situation situation that is so you know unbearable once you heal that and understand that we can't change people we can't change the things around us and once we start to look at ourselves and making the changes in ourselves then we can see the true 
um, light of who we are coming out then we can spread peace and love through the energy through our energy vibration then we can have success in ways that which we weren't um, in ways that was that you know we were not even be aware of so this is going to be good okay whatever the situation is whatever that was happening the masculine aspect of yourself will be healed on Thursday on Friday we have the energy vibration of uh, um, the energy of uh, um, balance okay and this balance is a powerful one because you have to deal with a Virgo so on Friday a lot of you people will be dealing with the Virgos whatever the situation is there's a news that is coming from someone who is Virgo and um, whatever the news is it's going to be good whatever the news is it's going to be good it's someone who is very understanding is someone who um, touch you from your soul and is someone that is going to help you to bring in positive light um, into your world and this is good so on Friday there is going to be a message that is coming in for the Virgos as we move forward we have the energy vibration from the um, the Prince of Pentacles the Prince of Pentacles this is a situation that some people are in relationship with someone between always as um, a, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn between the ages of 18 and 20 and 35 and this person comes in and is going to work together with you to build a strong foundation so whoever you are expect that this person this man is going to come in and help you to build a strong foundation in your life and you're going to work in a group a sort of a group and this is going to help you to move yourself forward this is going to be very very positive for you scorpion so whoever this person is, it can be your boss it can be someone at work but together working together is going to bring you a positive positive situation you're going to be making money in the future as we move on on Sunday and the last day we have relax you need to relax so we have the four of sword whatever the situation is we have the energy of the four of sword and on Sunday you're taking rest and you're looking within to see how far you have come you're trying to find inner wisdom in different situation and different aspect of who you are you're trying to find the inner wisdom that lie dormant in you or asking for inner wisdom to guide you your accent for your inner light to guide you forward and this you will receive because you have the energy of the ace of the um, ace of cups so this is a positive week and you know um, this the energy of the heart is really changing because in a week where there's fire and the earth energy but I guess with the energy of the fire and the earth energy this is bringing a lot of balances for you scorpions because the earth people and the earth situation always bring balance for you guys so this is a really positive so new love new love is coming in a lot of your your lives a lot of situation that are going to be happening are coming in your life so this is going to be extremely positive so whatever the situation is we're understanding how we're dealing with certain situation love is um, um, the powerhouse of this week new love new love new situation new possibilities new love are coming in your life it doesn't really matter what is happening new love new possibilities good things new things are coming in your life it's going to be wonderful you have the energy of the magician and the Sun which is a good um, situation that is happening new love is happening and this new love is coming in different ways in your life it can be a new um, love affairs it can be new partnership or you can be planning on getting married um, new people you're meeting new people whatever the energy of new love is coming in that means you are going to meet someone who's going to play a significant role in your life and it's going to be a long hold uh, a, a very strong long hold of uh, um, certain situation that is going to be happening in your life so this is going to be really positive so 
and here we are looking at uh, you know certain different aspects of who we are and trying to understand who we are but yet still holding up and going on a journey within to look for the inner um, the inner light and peace within us because we want to um, bring out the energy of the power within us and this is going to be good whatever the situation is oh my gosh <laughs> whatever the situation is we are going to be surviving um, um, this situation and we are going to be happily moving forward in our lives and understanding that we're all here on a journey and this journey is going to be um, one of wonderful um, wonderful situations which will be happening and this is going to be good so here we are let's see what colors because your number is three you have the energy of the number three let's see what chakra you'll be working with in this week um, the separating that's not really what but you are in the position of trying to see yourself finding yourself and finding your way out of certain things so this is a very very um, possible the number the yellow is the energy of Archangel um, Uriel and call up on the universal ray the beams of um, that brings in the Sun energy acts the Sun to flow through you and surround you acts the Sun to heal your aura and your energy vibration this is really a positive one okay for everyone so this is really positive so as we go forward we're using the answers from the angels so if there's any question you have in this week ask your questions because we are about to receive a answer for you ladies and gentlemen let's see what we have <laughs> recovery so this is good whatever is happening there's a recovery that is happening in your life there is really recovery that F is happening in your life so this is good this is positive whatever the situation is this is a good and positive situation of recovery so a lot of things are happening in your life there is a recovery um, that is happening in your life and this is really positive so ladies and gentlemen boys and girls new love are coming in your life please remember to listen to your Sun uh, moon and rising and listen to um, the monthly reading again um, go to the the um, where the fourth week is and um, I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back and I will speak to you next week.